I want to talk about lust or this experience. So if you are someone that is very sensitive and you don't want to hear about this, hey, no hard feelings, right? <laughs> Anyways, I was listening to some teachings, teachings about God. I don't watch any secular TV shows or movies. Now, if there is something that I am trying to fix or something like that, I may watch some videos about it. But other than that, I don't mess with anything that don't pertain to God, video-wise. Anyways, I went to my Facebook and I saw that this woman was trying to add me and I don't really add everyone because some people have very evil intentions like they may make it seem like they want to learn about God but in truth they are trying to put you in sin so I checked this woman's profile and she was halfway dressed like no i am not going to add this person so i went back to looking at the videos about the teachings and stuff like that then all of a sudden perhaps 10 or 20 minutes later i started to feel really sexually aroused and I was like, what is going on? I don't have any interest to have sex before marriage. I don't have any interest to watch pornography. I really don't. So I was having these thoughts of wanting to masturbate or wanting to find a woman and have sex with her and stuff like that. Some really foolish thoughts. So I was thinking, how in the world am I thinking about this while looking at teachings about God? We have to know that God is not going to give you sexual thoughts. God is not going to make you sexually aroused to want to do sinful things with other people. He is not going to do that. So if it is not God or spirits of God, then it have to be demons, right? So that means if you are feeling sexually aroused and you are having thoughts that are trying to push you to do sexual sins, that would have to mean that demons are in your midst. They are near you. I pray that this makes sense. When you are living for God, God gives you, when you are following his rules and regulations, God gives you authority over demons. So I was like, demons, I bind and cast you out right now. And I was saying this loud. And I was still kind of feeling that sexual, I want to have sex feeling. So I continued to say that. Demons, I bind and cast you out right now. Leave now. And I was not feeling it as much, but I was still feeling that sexual feeling. And I was getting a tad bit irritated. So something came to my mind about that woman that was trying to add me or that man, or, well, it was a woman's picture on there. And I was thinking, perhaps by looking at that picture,
that somehow transferred a demon to me or something like that. So I said, any demon that has been transferred to me, any connection or whatever else, I sever it, I cut it loose, I break it right now in Jesus' name. And seconds after that, I was not aroused. So what am I trying to say to you? You don't have to give in to lust. When you are feeling lustful, know that, know that a demon is in your midst. For instance, you are right here and a demon can be like right here right by you, waiting, pushing you, influencing you, yes, to sin sexually, whether through masturbation or sex. I pray that this makes sense. You don't have to give in. Because I know for a fact that I am not that way. So let me stop right here. God bless.